And Kim Crates are talking with Iona forward E.J. Crawford. Uh, E.J., you've been through this uh, now three times. What is it like for you? Oh, uh, two times, but I'm sure it's different. What is it like uh, and, and seeing the name North Carolina pop up? Uh, you know, it's just great. You know, North Carolina, they're, they're a storyline team. You know, got a Hall of Fame coach, great program, you know, a lot of future pros. So I just told my guys don't go out there and play basketball. You've been such a rock of this team. It was struggling in January into February, but uh, you uh, and uh, Ricky McGill were able to show the leadership necessary to turn the season around. What, what did you realize you had to do? Uh, you know, just knock out all the outside noises. A lot of people were saying, like, when we were 2 and 9, like, this is not a good Iona team. So I just told them, man, just don't listen to that. Just keep coming in the gym, working hard. We'll get it together. And you have so much consistency in the way you play. Everybody depends on you, and uh, you can just see it on the court on defense and also running the offense. Well, what is it like to, be, to play your role on the team? Uh, this is great because, you know, I put a lot of time in. You know, this summer, you know, I really put a lot of time in on my body, on my game, my overall game. So for me to, like, be, like, one of the main players is great. EJ, congratulations. Best wishes on your trip to the NCAAs. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thank you. Well, have a good one. to the tournament riding a hot streak? Well, of course, you know, we won 10 in a row. You know, like I said, everyone found their spots. You know, if you just go out there, share the ball and play on the basketball, I feel like we could compete. You're one of the returners from last year's team and obviously you have big dance experience. What have you shared with your teammates? Uh, you know, just go out there and just be composed. You know, it's gonna be, you know, filled with all Tar Heel fans, you know, people yelling, you know, just, just play out on the basketball. You know, at the end of the day, it's basketball. You know, you gotta put the ball in the rim. So if you just go out there and play ball, you know, it should be fun. What have you learned the last couple of days about North Carolina? Uh, it's, they're big, they're deep, you know, they're a good team, you know. If you go out there, you know, stay to the basics, you know, help each other on defense, you know, share the ball, feel like we could compete. You guys have tried to run and kind of play your game the last three years, or a couple of years you were there. Mm -hmm. Do you do anything differently? They're, I mean, they're one of the fastest playing, you know, tempo teams in the country. Mm -hmm. Do you do anything differently? Do you adjust? Do you, do you not play like Iona's game this week? Nah, we're going to play Iona basketball. You know, yeah, they're probably bigger than us, faster than us, but. You know, if we help each other, like I said, you know, we should be able to compete. Coach said he was going to have you guys watch film mm -hmm. of the Duke game and see some of the opportunities you guys had and, you know, what you could have taken advantage of if you played a little better in that game. Mm -hmm. Did you do that this week? And what, what do you kind of learn from your experience there last year? Oh, yeah. You know, we watched so much film, you know, from the from when they played uh, Davidson, you know, so much film. So, you know, we're just going to go out there and just play. EJ, is, is defense a key for you in a game like this? Uh, you know, of course, you know, they got a lot of shooters, you know, like Cam Johnson, he shoots 47% uh, from the trade ball. So, you know, we've got to close out, you know, help each other, you know. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a tough game. It's gonna be tough. Is it different playing a slower offense? Um, yeah, uh, for sure, because, you know, then, like, they get up and down, you know, we've got to get back. You know, Kobe White's one of the fastest guards in America, so we've got to get back. How do you, do you, a lot of people aren't giving you guys a, a shot. Now, yeah, at all. I've seen do, it. Yeah, what do you guys do to kind of use that as for motivation? No, just, you know, you just take it all in. You know, nobody thinks we're going to win, you know, except for us. So, you know, we're going to go out there, you know, compete, play hard, have each other's back, and, you know, just live with the results. What do you and Ricky say to guys that haven't played these games before, that haven't played in the NCAA? What advice do you give them about not getting too, too caught at the moment? Um, you know, just just relax. You know, you like I said, you're going to go out there. It's going to be a big arena. You know, we're not really used to playing in arenas, playing in the MAC, but playing in arenas is going to be filled. You know, all Tar Heel, you know, just stay in yourself. You know, don't try to do things you don't do. So just play basketball. Did Coach show you the UMBC game, or did you watch it on your own, beating Virginia last year? Yeah, I did. You know, one of my good friends, Arkell, you know, he played on the team. So, you know, I watched film on that, you know. Like them, I, he told me, you know, just come out, just play just play basketball. Like, at the end of the day, you got to put the ball in the rim like they do. You know, put your shoes on like they do. So, just basketball, yeah. 
what does that mean that it's just been done just last year? I mean, they were like, I think the number one overall seed. Mm -hmm. 16 is beating a one. To give all the guys on this team in this building the belief that this can be done. We can pull this off. Yeah, for sure. You know, anything can be done in basketball. You know, you just you don't have to be better than them, but you could, you just got to be better than them that day. So if you're better than them for 40 minutes, then you know, hopefully you get the W. What about the whole experience? What's so special about playing in the NCAA tournament? It's, I mean, it's a blessing. You know, every kid's dream is playing a big dance. You know, for us to be here four years in a row is just, just a blessing, really. And how do you match up well, well, well with them? They, they're a very similar team. They have a very similar style. Than mm -hmm. you, guys. you know, they like to get up and down, you know, play fast. You know, it's just they're just a little bigger. Like I said, you know, we got to get back on defense, you know, play smart, you know, take care of our possessions, and then feel like we could compete. Thanks, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thank you, AJ.